Hello, I'm doing a video on how to use your Xbox controller for your computer or laptop or whatever you want to use it on. So, first you've got to go to xpadder.en.malvidia.com. I'll put the link in the description and download the Xpadder free version. Once you have that, you'll need to like install it and everything and then you'll get this exe file program which you need to run if you uh, if you have windows 7 you need to troubleshoot compatibility and it will run it for you so it, it will work okay so now we've got this is what I have already done to my controller so I can play it for Call of Duty and um, I've just like put the mouse here middle mouse button as my click my uh, and all the other controls are pretty self-explanatory apart from this little F here this one has got both R and F both selected at one time what you need to do to do this is go on advanced and just put F and R here. Okay. So to get all these buttons here apparent, because you should have just a grey blank screen here. You click on the little controller thing and you go on settings. This will bring up this controller settings, my controller. Yours should say Xbox if you've got an Xbox controller or Mad Cats if you've got a Mad Cats one. So you've got to enable both your sticks, enable the D pad, um, and enable triggers, and then we move on to buttons. To use a button, you need to click on the button, including the um the stick clicks, and put them well, they will just appear in a certain spot, random spot. And you just drag it into the place where you want your controller to look like, unless you really don't care. And you're like really smart and know what you're doing. So once you've got all your buttons selected, you can test them by like clicking them. And then X that off. Um, and there's your display to set it up. It's pretty simple. You just click on it, and then you just click on the button. So I use like these for moving, aim, shoot, grenade, flashbang. Then I've got N five six seven. Now N is only for COD four because I use it for night vision goggles. And I don't know if it's on Modern Warfare 2, but I'm not sure anyway. Uh, 5 is for um, using your like grenade launchers, C4, claymores and all that. 6 and 7, as I don't have Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, I think that you can use them for Modern Warfare 2. But I just have them there just in case there's an extra button or something I need to select and I'll just put it as 6 or 7. Then, yeah, one to change weapon, C to crouch, space to jump, and then them two to reload and activate. I'll use the mouse for these to use. Oh, what's this? I use the mouse for these, and uh, to do it, there's the little mouse bit on the right, and you just click on the arrows, the arrow that you want to be it. So that's pretty, pretty, pretty much all there is to it. I will now end the video, and hopefully you can do it. Don't forget to subscribe.